obstacles in the family members. Sometimes the obstacles of sicknesses, Lord God. Sometimes the obstacle of relationship, Lord God. And we so get sidetracked by these obstacles. And sometimes we say, Lord, I want to give up, Lord God. I cannot take this anymore. I, want, I just want to quit, Lord God. Lord, what else can I do? Yes. I think just by focusing on Jesus, then we can continue. Just by looking at Him, just focusing our eyes on Him, then we can move on. We can continue. If we just look at ourselves, we will stumble. We fell down. But if we look at you, we know that you'll come to us. When we are in time of trouble, and you will reach up your hands to us, and you will pull us up again. So we can walk with you again. We walk together. Because you are a good Lord. So we, we, we just want, Lord God, to have our eyes fixed on you. They never let you go. The moment we let go our eyes from you, the moment we start feeling the burden of our life, the, mo the moment we, we lose focus on you, we start feeling depressed. We start feeling Heart, heart break, heart broken, Lord God. So, Lord God, I like to ask you, Lord God, help us, help us to see you always. Help us to see you in problems right now, Lord God. Help us that we 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 see that this is opportunity to get close to you. That all the problems that we have right now, Lord God, is just that it's opportunity for you to come and reach us to us. So Lord God, help us Lord God to see you better every day in our heart.
to start praying with me together for this community. We just uh, extend our hands towards them. And you, we just uh, ask you all, all of you to sit down as we pray for you. Lord God, hallelujah, hallelujah, Lord God. Lord Jesus Christ, you are the foundation, you are the cornerstone, Lord God. You are the one who joined all of us together, Lord God. Lord God, like the cornerstone that joined this whole structure, so you can become the dwelling place in this place, Lord God. Lord, this community is about unity, Lord God. And without unity, you are not here, Lord God. So, Lord God, we just want to follow your example. Because when people betray you, when people accuse you, when people spit on you, Lord God, when people scorch you, you say nothing. And when they is crucified you, you intend to forgive them. Lord God, we pray right now, Lord God, that we want to follow your example, Lord God. That we have the heart that able to forgive. Lord God, we don't want it during our last days that you say, I don't know you. Because you never forgive. Lord God, I pray right now with other brothers here and sisters here, Lord. We ask in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, by the power of the most awesome God, that we all can be released, released from all the angers, released from all the bitterness, to forgive Lord we ask Lord God to touch everyone in this place right now Lord Jesus Christ Lord send forth your Holy Spirit touch everyone of us here Lord fill us with your spirit of forgiveness and love Lord God we also ask you, Lord God, give us the strength and the humility, Lord God. If we have something, that things that we do that offend our brothers and sisters, things that we do that offend our husband or wife or our children, things that create a division in our household, in this community or in our workplace, Lord God. Lord, we pray right now to, that your Holy Spirit to move mightily and powerfully so we can say, I'm sorry. That we can say, please forgive me. Lord God, give us this kind of strength and humility, Lord God, so we can do what you want us to do, Lord God. To have a peace with one another. To have a reconciliation with one another, Lord God. Because this is your house. And we are just the stone, Lord God. To be used by you, Lord God. But we need that before we can move as a community. Lord God, we pray as all the community to give us that spirit. So the Spirit of God, we pray, fill every one of us here. The Spirit of God to touch every one of us here, Lord God. The Spirit of God to move powerfully in this place, Lord God. The Spirit of God to chase us, Lord God. Even the heart that cannot be chased right now, Lord God. Lord, we know that you will make a way for us right now in this place, Lord God. Lord God, because once we have a reconciliation, once we have the peace with one another, then your spirit will move in this.
this place, Lord God. Amen. Let your blessing will start coming down upon this place. Let your blessing will, will have in every one of us here. Because you all dwell where the people gather together and praise your holy name. So Lord God, may we be united in one heart, mind and body. May we cast all the negative thoughts we have towards one another. In Jesus' name, cast it out to Him. Cast it out to Jesus Christ. All your angers, all your bitterness, all the unforgiveness. In Jesus' name, we will make all things possible. Because for, for us, it's not possible. For, for God, everything is possible. Amen. Hallelujah. So just lift your heart to Him. Surrender your heart to Him right now, brothers and sisters. And let Him move and touch you. And, and you will surprise how He will change your life by saying, Lord, I'm sorry. Lord, I want to change my life right now, Lord God. Lord, I want you to forgive me for my wrongdoing. And Lord God, I like to forgive those who hurt me. And the Lord hear our prayer from heaven. So Lord God, we you want to praise you. We would like to glorify you. And we know that you are in this place right now, Lord God. Because when we are gathered here, we are the we are all the, the body and you are the head and you are here right now. You're touching us right now. You're healing us right now. Because we surrender ourselves to you. Because we want to be used by you. And we, we don't want any hindrances for you to come into our heart right now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your Holy Spirit right now. Thank you for moving in our heart and mind right now, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus, for using us. Thank you, Lord. Mama Mary. Thank you, Mama Mary. We know that you're praying with us from the start to finish right now. You're praying with all the angels and saints in heaven right now. Pray for us. We pray for all the individual petitions and needs right now. So we just lift up to you. That you will intercede for our prayers right now. All that we have right now. All the desires that we have. All the things that we write in the envelope right now. We live up to you, Mother Mary. Then you will pray for us and you will intercede for us right now. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And we, we give you the glory. We give you the honor. To God be the glory. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah. So let's give thanks to the Lord Yahweh El Shaddai. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters, let's offer your prayer requests also. Let's give up to the Lord God.